I wanted to try the latest Ice Link Express LS on my helicopter, so I tried it. Today, I would like to share my setup with you. I focused on implementing the radio setup as simple as possible while still implementing all the features of the Viva. According to the claims of Express LRS developers, Express LRS has a communication method called FLRC mode with extremely low latency and high packet rate. I think FLRC mode is good for the helicopters. Of course, it may be difficult to actually feel the difference compared to other modern radios like Futaba, Spectrum, and etc. Express LRS can select various speculate modes depending on the purpose, and among them, my helicopter was set as the fastest FLRC 1000 mode with a Gemini transmitter measure. One thing to note when using Express LRS on a helicopter is that there are two different channel resolution for two groups of channels. The FLRC 1000 mode of Express LRS has 12 channels. Channels 1 to 4 have a full resolution of 10 bits, 1000 to 24 steps, and the channels 5 to 12 have a relatively lower resolution of 7 bits, 128 steps. So channels 1 to 4 need to be assigned to the control surfaces. Here is my settings. Viva receiver tab at start top menu. I assigned it like this. My radio have AETR order. Collective is channel 3. Aileron is channel 1. Elevator is channel 2. Tail is channel 4. Auxiliary 2 is channel 7 for tail gain. It combined bank switch. Auxiliary 3 is channel 6 for throttle. It combined bank switch and radio's bright mode for slow motor sprope. Motor is channel 5. It combined arming of express LRS feature. Bank switch is channel 8. Rescue is channel 9. And check center point and end point. Click the MDL key and find the off menu. I assign the value like that. Viva center value is 15, 20, and the maximum and minimum values are like this. Plus minus 418.3. All channels are same. And the input setting is here. Input menu is default. You can adjust the rate and exponential at input menu. And the mixer, the heart of radio. The channel 1 to 4 is default, AETR order. I use channel 3 for collective and channel 6 for throttle. Channel 6 is multiplexed 3 lines, normal, I drop 1, I drop 2. The first line, normal, have delayed for initial slow pull up. The throttle curve looks like this, normal, either of 1, either of 2. Also, channel 6 is combined flight mode for slow pull up. The flight mode 2 and 3 have a paid in for slow pull up. Channel 6 is not assigned any switch keys, but the combined flight mode is assigned a 3 position SC key. The channel 5 is arming feature of Express LRS and Viva motor run. The channel 7 is for tail rate. It is assigned the 3 position SC key and combined flight mode and Viva bank switch. Check these numbers for gyro gain. Channel 7 is 7 bit. So if you want a more precise setup, you can adjust the center point, sub trim, and end point at off menu. The channel 8 is for bank switch of Viva. The channel 9 is for rescue switch. It needed a curve. And special function, assign motor curve for safety, using a C key. And others, timer settings and reset a special function. Next, set up Express LRS. Transmitter is Beta FPB Super G Gemini. Packet rate is F1000. Antenna mode is Gemini. Check the LED on the receiver has red light. Receiver setup is here. S-Bus output, Gemini mode. 
and radio setup, check the bow rate. For F1000 faculty rate, you must choose over 400 kHz. I choose 1.87 MHz. It works good for loading of RUA script. 